All right, in this lab, we're studying plate tectonics and how the plates move. Um, so we're going to talk to this lab to cover the three types of plate boundaries. And this is my helper, Molly. She's already um, broken apart her crust. How's the crust taste, Molly? Good? All right, so you, what you want to do is you want to take the knife and you want to kind of divide the center a little bit. You need a center line because you and your um, helper are going to pull and push apart these um, this candy bar to represent the three types of plate boundaries. So the first one that we're going to demonstrate is the normal fault. It's a divergent plate boundary. So you and your helper, would you like to be my helper? Grab a hold of this end of the candy bar and pull. Grab a hold of mommy's candy bar and we're both going to pull. Are you ready? Pull. All right, you see the crust start to break apart. You get that? Uh, in a divergent uh, boundary, the crust separates. And what you see along divergent boundaries are lava spews, geysers, and new crust will form where these have pulled apart. Okay, that's the first one. The divergent boundary is where two plates pull apart. Okay, the second one that we're going to do is the uh, transform plate boundary. The transform plate boundary are two plates that slide past each other. Nothing new is created, but cracks and breaks are common. You'll see these among valleys and undersea canyons. So to demonstrate this one, Molly, are you going to do this one? Yeah. We're going to move them past each other. So they're going to slide past each other. And um, transform plate boundaries, the one that's the most popular is the San Andreas Fault in California. And these two plates are just sliding, creating rifts and upheaval of the crust. And um, they're, they're not actually that common. Transform plate boundaries are the least common. Okay, now the last one we're going to have a little fun with. The last one is the convergent plate boundary. That's for two plates collide. So in this one we're going to push both the sides of the candy bar together and they are going to meet and you may see your candy bar start to crumble and at this point um, a mountaintop has formed. So this is the type of plate boundary called a reverse, uh, reverse fault and this is formed from compression and pushing two sides okay. together. Two no. plates move toward each other and collide. You'll see volcanoes, mountain ridges, and they are responsible for the er the world's Volcano. most powerful okay. earthquakes. Okay, so those are the three types of plate boundaries. Divergent, move apart, transform, move past each other, and the convergent, which pushes both plates together.